has just been unbelievable and I'm, you know, I'm so grateful. I've always said that the game owes me nothing, I owe it everything and, and I honestly mean that. Playing cricket for me was certainly that, to be able to get out of bed every day and five o'clock in the morning open the curtains and pray to God it's not raining so I could walk out and, and play, whether it be for my club, my state or my country. My parents never pushed either of my sister or I to play a certain sport. It was more go and try everything when you're young and then whatever you fall in love with and um, commit to that and, and have the discipline and give yourself every chance. I'm extremely grateful to both my, my parents and my sister for, for helping me, you know, take this cricket journey. Pick a football, uh, hit a cricket ball, um, you know, hockey's growing in the country, soccer's growing in the country, so we have, we have a lot of choice. I think that's probably, you know, on one hand a positive, on the other hand that's the challenge. And I think that's where we need to be very careful to allow young boys and girls to do what they want to do. It's, it's their journey, it's their choice, it's their life. Training is as much about my mind as it is my body, you know, staying active is, it keeps me sane. I was so structured and organised with my career, I had to have eight hours sleep, I had to eat certain foods, I need to do, needed to do rehab, recovery, uh, you know, my training was so structured, otherwise I thought I couldn't perform, yep. and I couldn't perform at my best. My dream was to play cricket for Australia, I didn't know what came with that, I didn't know that um, you had media commitments, I didn't know so much more about the off-field stuff, and I think, um, you know, I tried to learn as I, as I grew. I had to make some tough decisions that were in the betterment of the team. I haven't, I haven't done anything wrong. I just did it my way. The negative stuff I would read, and I felt like I was reading it in bold letters. It was like the font was this, this small, but I would read it this big. Do you think your players liked you when you were captain? I don't think I can answer that. You've got to have some idea. I, I know they respected me as their captain. I know they th believed in the calls I made and they knew that I would put that team in front of any personal relationship. Do you think respect is more important than Definitely. liking? I would love both, but I care about one. <laughs>